All right, players. Drive in the far court. Utah on the near court. Game one, time in. Let's zero, do this. Zero. This Arizona team, Roscoe, one. had one of the thrilling matches today. They took the New Jersey Fives to a dream breaker out on the grandstand court zero. earlier today, but eventually came up short. Yeah, I was able to catch a peek of that. Side out, point one. And Utah came up short against the DC Pickleball team. That match was yesterday. One, one. Trying to make amends right here, right now. Tied at one. Side out, point two. So Alex drew wrong to serve. Two, one. Truong, the big overhead. Point. Smart idea from Schneeman. I think Truong saw it a little bit early, so she was able to get a step back there, put it away, but Three, something one. that definitely works. Do you see an X Point. factor right now in this particular game? What do you think is going to be the difference? I think it's a little too early to tell right now. I think Four, MLB one. is amazing because anything can happen. Personally, I think it's up Side to out. Caitlin Point Christian two. and Alex Strong and how they perform right here. Mm -hmm. I think that's going to be the X factor. Two, four. Point. I think you would normally say Alex Truon being the youngster on the court. Maybe the most pressure going to be on her here on championship court, but Three, I think by four. now she is comfortable playing in these surroundings. Side out, point five. Yeah, Lacey has an MLP championship under her belt. Callie's clearly a veteran, played a lot of MLP. Kaylin Christian three. and Alex Strong, new to the Premier League. Neiman sneaks one in. Point four. I think Callie had a chance to take that one and attack it maybe out of the air, saw it a little late, decided to reset it, and Schneeman was able to take it out of the air, put it through four, the middle for five. a while. Mm -hmm. Oh, true on razor Side sharp point six. with those hands. 6-4 lead here for the Black Diamonds just Six, underway. Four. Women's doubles. Side out, point five. Five, six. Callie Smith into the net that time. Callie Smith just had some great partners over the years. Catherine Parento back in the day. Six, six. Lucy Kovalova most recently. And there's Callie. Side out. I Point. love the way Seven. Alex is leaning in on that right side and taking balls out of the air, creating a lot of pressure for Caitlin Christian. So good start Seven, here for six. the Black Diamonds. Just a one point lead. Point. Eight, six.
Uh, Cali comes up to attack. Crowd loving it. Oh, what a wow. point. What's the ruling there? It seemed like the ball bounced on Utah's side and then went back into the net and then they made a play mm. off the net. Yeah, it was Nine certainly six. interesting. Would love to see that replay maybe if we get a chance later. 9-6 now. Oh, right now all the mojo is on the side of Utah. Good pressure there from Cali. Three straight here for the Black Diamonds. Ten, six. So right now they're absolutely rolling. Kind of think at this point, another point. Arizona may want to think about a timeout. Lacey Schneeman easily puts it away. So much power there from Lacey. One of the hardest hitting girls on the court right now. Seven, 11. Lacey Schneeman, such a great all around athlete growing up. And scored that time by Christian. Mentioned Schneeman's body of work in athletics basketball, volleyball, soccer, gymnastics, softball. And then, of course, tennis and pickleball. Eight, she really did it all. You try to tell the young athletes today, Roscoe, play everything. Don't just commit to one particular sport, but that's easier said than done. Nine, 11. Certainly has made her, though, the ultimate competitor here in professional pickleball. There she is again. Yeah, we'll, let's see if Caitlin Christian tries to find that inside foot of Alex Trong. She popped that one up, left it a little high. When something works, you usually see them go back to it, see if it keeps working. 10, 11. So Utah had scored four straight. Arizona came back with three of their own. And that one just finds a spot right in the corner. Unlucky there for Callie. Bit of a low pull there from Caitlin. 11, 11. Tied at 11. So I'm seeing a little bit of a theme here. Lacey getting the thirds and driving at Alex. I don't know if that was discussed before the match. 12, 11. So both teams going on the runs here. And Alex Truong here to break the tie. So 13-12 brings us to our first time out here in this match. The Black Diamonds here throughout the weekend. Callie Smith will serve it up. First real lob we've seen, and Schneeman will make them pay. Yeah, insane athleticism there from Schneeman. Crazy power on that overhead. I think it was a smart idea. 13, 13. Hey. Kelly Smith comes right back, trying to keep Alex engaged as possible here. Black Diamonds with a one-point lead. Oh, missed there by Christian. I like the idea.
Yeah, you mentioned Callie Smith being one of the OGs. For some of those OGs, a lot of fans kind of wonder, is the game going to kind of pass them by? You're not going to really see them compete anymore. But Callie's still very much atop the board as far as overall talent in the sport. Players like her and the Matt Wrights still staying relevant here in 2024. Yeah, I think they've adapted well, um, especially the ones who are still putting 50, the work and the hours on the court. Because the game has gotten so much more athletic, especially over the last three years. Players like Schneeman and Christian, perfect examples of that. Neither team really able to separate thus far. ATP, Caitlin Christian, and unsuccessful. Callie Smith right there to make the call. Again, very good idea. I think just a little bit wide there. Sixteen, sixteen. Looks like it just missed. Oh, good dig that time by True on. how good it is when Lacey drops the paddle 17, on her forehand 16. side. It's so hard to read from experience of being on the other side of it. Mm. Side out, point 17. She's tough to kind of figure out when you're on the opposite side. Yeah. 17, 17. Now 18, 17, another lead change here. We've had several of them. Here in this first frame. 18, 17. Schneeman just 18. nails on top of the kitchen. I love the way she's taking the middle there, being aggressive with the ball out of the air. 18, 18. Black Diamond's trying to be the first to 20. Paddles may have collided that time. Schneeman just does not blink and puts it away. Such a good put away. Anything shoulder high on Schneeman is coming back like a rocket. Christian, one of her best shots here thus far. Twenty nineteen. So Arizona with a slight edge, but not by much. Point. And that will separate just a little bit. Feel the confidence right now, though, with the Arizona drive. They feel really good about what is going on. Alex Truon trying to keep him close. Side out, point 22. To the net. So Utah right there in the thick of it. Very tight match here. 21 22. Lots of momentum swings here in women's doubles. 
Truong answers the challenge, and we're tied. A great initial flick there from Cali, allowing 22. Alex to finish the point. Lacey's such an aggressive player. When her air count is low, it's so tough to play against her, and I think that's really the key. So 23 now for Arizona. 23-22. 23-22 right now. Oh, Schneeman can't take that one out. We are tied at 23. So vintage rally scoring here, back and forth. Yeah. Schneeman with a put away. Again, anything shoulder on Schneeman, it's so tough to return that ball. A great reach in to start from Caitlin Christian. And skips across the tape. A little luck that time. Doesn't hurt for the Arizona drive. Tough way to end for Utah. And really one of the faces of Gen Z pickleball putting it in play to start us off in men's doubles. So Jay DeVilliers on the court. The flying Frenchman, 29-year-old. Resides in Wichita, Kansas. Household name in the game in the far court. And also, just Side shot out. that Point. shot, Tyler One. Loon, the 32-year-old, the Ernie King, the Southpaw, One. and One. the former BYU Cougar. Yeah. And for Tyler Loon, can't fail to mention also co-host of King of the Court, a very popular podcast Two. One. that I must say I watch every single week. Definitely, and Jimmy Miller is here watching. His co-host. Don't have to say where's Jimmy here this weekend because he <laughs> has made an appearance in Grand Rapids. Jimmy Miller, Point shout two. out to him. Very, very cool guy to talk to off the court. Very two, good podcaster. Lob it up, and just a Side little out. bit Point off three. there, called by DeVilliers. There's Jimmy, helping out the Black three, Diamonds. Two. Of course, good friend Tyler Loom taking part in this one. ATP attempt, it would have been a tough one there for DeVilliers, and it's just wide. Point three. Three, three. So Four. you know when you play Tyler Loon, it's going to give you a lot of eye candy, and you got to kind of just stay Four, focused three. because this guy will drive you absolutely crazy, won't he? Yeah, he knows what he's doing out there. That's a lot of power right there, huh? I think we're going to see. Oh, well, let's take a look here. Four, four. Yeah, that's. Side out, point five. I think we're going to see most of the returns in general hit to AJ here, as five, Dylan has four. such a good third shot drop. Both teams kind of just bang away here. Oh, DeVillier Side tries out. to keep it alive. Point five. Great flick there from AJ. One of his top skills. Five, five.
I really like how AJ stayed patient there. He has a lot of firepower, a lot of creativity, but he really stuck Six, with the discipline shots there. And then he hits the third Side job. Out. <laughs> Big shot there by Devillier, tied at six. Exactly the type of game we expected. Neither team really given an inch here in the opening moments. Six, six. Oh. Side out, point seven. I think that ball sailing long, but Tyler touched it with the tip of his, tip seven, of his paddle. Six. You see a rare missed drop from Dylan Frazier there. Can't be perfect. Seven, seven. Side out, point, eight. Eight, seven. Dylan Frazier right there, just following it up. And now a two-point lead here for the Arizona Drive. Nine, seven. Point. Sick hands there from AJ. Mm. First time we've seen Tyler Loon make Point contact eight. on the Ernie. Yep. Eight, ten. Point. And that one's going to sail on Polo. So Black Diamonds here are going to pull within one. Nine, ten. Gonna pull us to within a tie. Deadlocked here at 10. 10, 10. Loon able to run it down, and there's Frazier just waiting for it to put to put it away. Yeah, beautiful play there. I think AJ saw Tyler and Jay leaning in and decided to throw up the lob. Super 11, smart. 10. Do you sense a consistent effort here to keep trying to pick on AJ Kohler? Not sure how much it's working for Utah. Definitely think with the dinking game and the thirds. Right there, Davila goes right at him. I think it has to be the game plan, especially when you have Dylan Frazier to your 11, right. 11. Absolutely. Nothing against the game of Kohler. How about this sequence? Just great defense by the Black Diamonds. Oh. Oh, wow. Tough way for Point that one to end. Yeah, great play there from everyone around. It almost sounded like the referee said out, but it was actually Jay there for a second. 12, Caught 11. me off guard. Yeah. Oh, it's in right down the middle. Side Best out. shot Point. so far from Loon. Beautiful shot from Loon. He was sliding to open up some space for him to hit that shot. Caught it a little bit early. 12, 12. Oh. 
Kohler goes for the Ernie. No damage done. There's Loon to follow it up. So what a flurry there for the Black Diamonds. They'll take a 13-12 lead to our first break. Utah and Arizona, a slugfest right now. Utah and Arizona, thrilled to bring this to you. Here at the Advil Targeted Relief Midseason Tournament. Side switch now, Utah in the near court. You do that. Can't finish it off there, but you love the effort. Yeah, it's so hard to pass these guys. Loon has such good resets, and Davillier covers 13, so 13. much court. Side out. Not bad, Point, huh? 14. Stellar play on both sides, I must say. Crowd really 14, enjoying 13. this one here. 7.15 Eastern time, 7.17 to be exact. So we get a little bit cooler out Point, here. Just a perfect pickleball night in Grand Rapids. Couldn't agree more. 14, 14. That one's going to go long. Side out. Point 15. 15, 14. Side out. Point 15. Couple quick 15, points. 15. Deadlock now at 15. That one's going to sail just long off the paddle of Frazier. Side out. Good reach in there by Jay Point, using 16. his length. I think you're right about targeting AJ. That's where most 16, of 15. the dinks are going. Point. And Kohler has spent a lot of time away from the game. First part of 2024. 17, Had a little bit of a hamstring injury as well, Roscoe. Told me that that has recovered nicely. Side out. Yeah, I was supposed Point. to play doubles 16. with him at a tournament, a PPA in North Carolina, and he hurt his hamstring 16, that 17. week. Come on. Side out. Point. 18. AJ's one of those rare pickleball players that doesn't have that tennis background. AJ and Dylan, actually. 18, 16. Yeah, with AJ, though, it came Side through out. hockey. Point 17. Always said he'd make a great hockey goalie, just the way he just seems so 17, solid, 18. so strong. Easy pickings for DeVille. Side out. Yeah, Point I think he was rushing in there. I think AJ should have had a split step, shut down his lower body, reset the ball then, 19, moved forward and come in. That's what makes AJ so great. It's the way he just sits in there with this paddle out and is able to flick the ball and do so much 18, with just 19. his wrist. Hmm. Some of the best hands in the game. There's another out. example of a shot that he probably should have shut down his legs on, stopped, reset, and not kept moving forward through the shot there. 20, 18. Drive trailing by two here. Black Diamonds trying to pull away. Side out, point 19. And now Arizona will get a side out here. 19, 20. Oh, are you kidding me? How did he do that? 
The number one player in the world right there. I mean, the Black Diamonds, watch, they're ready to celebrate this point. Look, they're about to give each other a high five, and then it comes back 20, unexpectedly. 20. That is Dylan Frazier for you. Does either team here have the edge, Roscoe? Who do you like here in the race of 25? It's so close and it's so hard to tell. I think it comes down to which AJ Kohler 20. we see. Mm. I think that's pretty on point. I think he may have just heard you. Point. Yep. 21. Twenty two, twenty one. Still a one point game. It's a lead change as we've had that will sail long. Deadlock to 22. The tension builds. Yeah, the drop bounced a little higher than I think AJ wanted it to, giving Jay that room to speed 22. up the ball. Utah really needs this one. They do not want to go down. Two games to none. Side out. Point 23. Pressure moments right here. 23-22. Oh, Lung and Davilia, their paddles nearly collide there. Point 23. But they both were on the same page. Timeout. Utah. So we're going to have a timeout here. 23. Utah, I think, wants to talk things over. How do you sort this out? I think with two forehands in the middle. Big point there. These four guys have put on a show. Jay Davilia and Tyler Loom. 23-23. De Villiers with the winner. Frazier says it's long. And will we have perhaps a challenge? It looks like we will. Uh, side out, excuse me. Side out, 24. Frazier is off the court right now, so. What are you challenging? The out call or that it, wait a minute. Are you challenging that it was out or that it did hit it? Okay, all right. So quick high five, Frazier to serve, All and right. let's see if Time the in. Black Diamonds can recover here. 24-23. And that's going to be just long, so Side Utah out. able to bounce back. 24. This is Major League Pickleball right here. And just as we thought it was a perfect night for pickleball. We've had a few raindrops here. Officials yeah. Players, come onto uh, the court. To stop play because of the rain. And we're going to stop Scores play here momentarily. Look around. There's just one little cloud that has moved in right over the court. And it's just kind of hovering over it right now. So as a precaution, of course, you don't want to have anybody injured here in MLP. This match is going to be brought to a quick pause. Hopefully, it's not a long delay. It does not look like more rain is going to follow it, but I don't want to be a meteorologist here. Time in. Sit back and enjoy MLP at its very 24. best. Time in. How about that shot oh. from Tyler Loon? Pulls the string out of the break. Pretty amazing there. And Jay DeVillia had to hit a third shot drop after sitting for 25, 15 24. minutes or so. 
Same point here. Kohler cannot put it over. Utah has answered the bell. De Villiers and Loom have evened this up at one apiece. And Loom mixed doubles. Tied at one. I like the energy here from the start from Smith and Loon. One, zero. Super crucial in these Major League Pickleball matches. Yeah, energy and vibe can be everything. Two, zero. Three nothing start Three, for zero. the Black Diamonds. There's Tyler Lewin. More, they are on their game here out of the gates. Zero. Big overhead from Long. How about five points in a row? Yeah, a little bit of a slow start here from Arizona. I would love to see them up their energy a little. Mat maybe match Five, the zero. energy of the Utah Black Diamonds here. Couple of funny bounces. And there is Callie Smith going the other direction. A 6 nothing blitz here in mixed doubles. I think we might see a timeout here soon if this lead continues. Six zero. Side out, point one. Sometimes that first point can be the toughest to get. Just reading everything like an open book right now. Yeah, again, I think energy is so important here. And Utah Black Diamonds just have so much more of it than the Arizona Drive. <laughs> Callie Smith has taken over this match. So the Black Diamonds are feeling it. The lead is now 9-1. Finally a timeout for Arizona. You have to wonder, did Arizona maybe wait a little bit too long? Right now, the woman of the moment, 9-1. The Black Diamonds dominating this first mixed doubles match. Lacey Schneeman needed to reach in the bag and pull out a great shot she just did. Yeah, smart time out there by the Arizona Drive. Let's see if they can shorten this lead here. All right, Roscoe, put your coaching hat on right now. If you're coaching, 
Arizona, how do you get back into this, this game here? So I think Lacey can be very aggressive, you know, at the baseline, even at the kitchen. I would love to see her play Tulum's backhand a little more, open up the court, and then use the open court to play aggressive. Schneeman, another side out here for the Black Diamonds. So major pressure put on Arizona right now. They cannot afford just to trade points. Wow. Schneeman hit it just wide. Great pickup there from Tyler Loom. Some of the best resets in the game. Oh, Loon trying Side to fly out. through Point with the bird that time. Came up just short. I don't think there's two players that exemplify five, what it means to be from the state of Utah. It's Tyler Loon and Callie Smith. Point. Tyler wants a BYU Cougar. Callie, of course, Six, suiting up 12. for Utah. That one sails on Schneeman. 13, timeout, change ends. 13 6. So 13 Utah. 6. 13 6. Roscoe, you said at the Side start, out. AJ Point. Kohler, Seven. the most important guy in this match for Arizona. 7 yeah, 13. I think. AJ is capable of so much. Yeah. <laughs> How about Kelly? Side out, point 14. When in the hands battle, she is doing it all right now. Such an 14, emotional seven. player. Great folk right there from Kelly. the aggressive thinking from AJ. He was taking over a lot of the court there, moving the ball around. They had a look at 15, an aggressive seven. shot there when they pulled Lung out to the backhand side. I think they should have taken a little bit more advantage of it and need to keep doing more of that. So a look of concern from Morgan Evans. Arizona's lost a little bit of their pace here in this game three. And you said it, sometimes Major League Pickleball, it's about body language, it's about enthusiasm. You just don't feel that vibe right now from the team in red and white. I couldn't agree more. Point. Beautiful flick there. I like how AJ is still playing aggressive, reaching in. 9-15. Loon will chase it down. Nearly runs right into the wall. Kohler, a miss hit. Everything going right for Utah. Yeah, I think that ball didn't come up as high as AJ would have liked. If he would do it over again, I bet he would take the ball out of the air. 16-9. Great pressure there from Callie. 
Well, she just looks so determined right now. She is in the zone. 17, nine. Go, go, go. Side out, point 10. Point there for Kohler. We've been watching Callie Smith dominate. Callie Smith so talented in many different 10, things, 17. playing the piano, cooking, working out, of course, spending time with her family. Husband Kyle, usually a mainstay at, at events. 18. And another reminder, Roscoe, his players have families. A lot of them, they've got children. Lots of things going on, not just pickleball. Yeah, as the 18, sport becomes 10. more professional, they're dedicating a lot of time and sacrificing a lot to be here. Great Sign play out. there from Cole. Sort of makes it mean that much more. 11, 18. AJ Kohler now with a seven point deficit for Arizona. Side out, point 19. Nineteen, eleven. 11. Yeah. There's the forehand again of Callie Smith. If I'm Arizona here, I might even try to put AJ on the right just to mix things 20, up for 11. a minute. Put him in front of Callie, creating a little more pressure for her. See him drift over. And the poach works out. Side out. Insane Point power four. there. Wow. <laughs> Again, he's capable of so much. His hands are so fast. He's so talented at the kitchen line. 13, 20. Seven point deficit. Long way to go here for Arizona. Sail out again, Tyler Loon making Sign all out. the right calls. I like them opening up the Loon backhand there. It was a little high. I think when they have a little more time to be aggressive, the dinks, then they go there. Everything from Utah right now just crisp. Yeah, very determined from both players. 22 in that team. 13. That's the ball Point, they need to 14. be hitting more of this match. Fourteen twenty two. So some life here from the drive. Even if they do not win this game to build some momentum. Going into that second 15, mixed 22. doubles match, I think would go a long way here. For sure. Side out. That goes Point. long, but we're frustrated. And it's 23-15, two away here for the Black Diamonds. They have played as well as you could possibly play here. Side out. Point 16. Neiman has been 16, a bit quiet here in this mixed double sequence. Side out. And now point it's game point. Yeah, a little sloppy there from Sheeman. I think they're feeling the pressure. 
that Lung and Callie have been bringing this match. AJ Kohler to easily put away. Point 17. So side out here back to Arizona. Remember, you got to win on the serve if you are Utah. ATP executed. Tyler right there to defend it. Loom's defense has been outstanding. And now it's second game point. 24-17. And there it is, the Utah Black 25, Diamonds. 25-17, Utah 25, Black 17. Diamonds. 25-17, impressive in the first mixed doubles match. So, we'll step aside. Game four, so, Jay DeVillier zero, zero. and Alex Truong on the other side, representing the Utah Black Diamonds. We're underway, second mixed doubles match. First shot, miss it by Christian. I like that she's reaching in, playing aggressive from the start. We'll see if she continues to do that. One, zero. Side out, point, one. One, one. Utah so still with the energy, Roscoe. Yeah, it's such a crucial thing here at MLP. The energy, Two, the determination when you go out there can really make or break a match. Dance battle. <laughs> that is Side not out. one you want to get into Two. with not Dylan Frazier. I love the way that Caitlin Christian is reaching Two. in the kitchen Two. right now and shrinking. The dinking area for Alex Strong. Side out, point three. Three, two. Side out. Arizona trying point to get it three. going. going to be a crucial part of this match. Jay is such a big Four, human being out there. If he can insert himself into the court, I think they're going to see themselves with a win. Side out, point four. Side out now to the drive, tied at four. Four, four. Dylan Frazier, the number Five, one ranked four. men's doubles player in the world right now. Just had a remarkable 2024 Five. playing alongside J.W. Johnson. As far as mixed is concerned though, Roscoe, Five. still Five. trying to find that, that ideal partner. Hasn't really happened for him just yet. He got a little tall there with his legs on the counter. Six, five. I don't think he was ready for Trong to come at him like that. Side out, point six. Six, six. Side out, point seven. A rare missed third from Dylan there. He is one of the most consistent third shot drops in the game. Seven, six. Side out, point seven. 
Back and forth we go. Seven, seven. Kings trading points. Not at seven. Side out. Not much flow Point. so far Eight. to this particular game. Eight, A little seven. choppy here on both sides. Side out. Yeah, as we saw Eight. in the previous match, the way you start has such an impact mm -hmm. on the whole match itself. Eight, eight. I think right here we're seeing a little bit of the result of them sitting on the bench for a little bit. You know, they're dialing in their third shots. Sat up there a little bit, coming off the tape. De Villiers knew what to do Point. with it. Yeah, I'm lucky for Frazier. One-point game. Side out. Point nine. Several ties already. Utah trying to nine, nine. put this one to bed. Arizona trying to force a dream breaker. I think I have a feeling I know what the crowd wants to see. What's the call? <laughs> Seen a couple dream breakers here on championship court today. Excited there on the Arizona sideline. Arizona serving at 10-9. And the drive 10, here with nine. Christian will serve down a point. Oh, Frazier going to want that one back. Yeah, he was right on it. A little too big of a swing there. Caught it late. 10. There's that reach in that I was talking about earlier, Caitlin Christian. Such an effective play and really shrinks the kitchen for Alex Trom, who's dinking 10. across from her. Point. To Philly into the net. And a little separation now for the drive. They've got a 12 10 edge. 12 10. How about that shot by DeVillier? Side out, point 11. 11, 12. Finished by Frazier. You are Jay DeVillier. These are the moments 13, 11. where your Arizona. team's going to count on you to come through. Talked about that trade before the season began. This match to be determined on Pickleball TV. We will see you tomorrow. That is after this match, though, is concluded. It's been an entertaining one. Arizona and Utah just going at it from the start. Beautiful shot there from Alex Strong, keeping Dylan honest with his line. Oh. oh, what a point. Side out, point 14. Roscoe, that's as good as it gets from both teams. Yeah, the hands battles, one of the best parts about pickleball. Super entertaining, super 14, fun. 12. And there's De Villiers coming through. You know, it looks great on TV, but when you're this close, you have extra appreciation for just wicked eye-hand coordination. Completely. 13-14. Side yeah. out, point 15. Two-point edge now for the Arizona Drive. Dylan Frazier. 15-13. Alex 
Truong getting a little extra attention. De Villiers comes over to help out, Sign and it up. pays off. Point 14. Just love De Villiers' game. 14, He's got all the tools, Roscoe. Yeah, very well-rounded player. Oh, slides along the tape. Point. And it's a point for Utah and more on De Villiers. All that talent, you sometimes wonder why he doesn't have more gold medals next to his name, more championships 15, because, 15. man, he just does things that just make you say, wow. Yeah, I think there's a few players out there who might Sign stop him point. from 16. getting as many gold medals, keeping him in the semis or the quarters. However, a very, very talented player, especially 16, when he's 15. taking up so much court and being aggressive. One of those players keeping him from getting so many gold medals is Dylan Frazier over here. Great point. Yeah, Frazier's emergence with J.W. Johnson. Meanwhile, J.W. not 15. settling in on a partner. Went back to Pat Smith the early part of this year. Trying to refine that magic that point they had 16. several years back. Yeah. Just a one-point lead for the drive. True wrong, puts it in play. Yeah. Alex Truong emphatically. Youngest player on the court playing big. And again, great energy from the Utah Black Diamonds. 17-17. Side out, point 18. Arizona calmly gets side out. Let's see if they can 18, finally pull 17. away. Black Diamond's just not letting that happen thus far. Side out, point 18. I think the Black Diamond's making a statement we are not going anywhere. <laughs> in this particular game. 18, 18. Frazier and Christian, there's been several points. It's looked like that they were going to pull away, just haven't been able to do it. That one's wide. How about this, Utah with a lead. Again, I think it's energy. I think that's 19, 18. what can make or break these matches. Side oh, big miss there from 19. De Villiers. Nodded at 19. Off first to 20 to Villiers right now pumped up. They are five points away from 20, closing 19. out this day with a victory. Oh, let's play on. No way. Side out, point 20. Incredible gets there from Jay. Got a little knuck, lucky on the let court there, but Caitlin Christian to finish it off. 20, 20. Oh, Christian just did not 21. see it off the paddle that time. Devillier, the quick apology. She's been sitting on that backhand counter a lot. I think Jay went body there, was able to get her handcuffed and it 21, worked out. 20. Oh, left it up just a bit. Caitlin Christian, right in her strike zone. 
Yeah, she needs to keep leaning in. I think that's when she plays her best, especially when timeout she's being Utah, isolated like Jay and Alex are doing to her. She really can't give them that room to dink so well. Um, but just super, ha super happy to be here and part of this pickleball community. It's such an amazing sport and has brought so much to my life. Great to have you. Tied at 21. Dylan Frazier, perfect shot just on the wrist of Truong. A one-point game here, game number four. Arizona 22, trying to force that dream breaker. Frazier able to lift it off. Well, how many ties, how many lead changes are we going to have in this match? This is wild. So it makes MLP so fun to watch. 22, 22. Alex Truong having to grow up fast here in this environment. Certainly she's answered the challenge. Slugfest right now in Utah. Wow. Able to get the better of it. I love the lean in there from Caitlin Christian, but Alex Truong was ready. 23, 22. Yeah, it comes back, yeah, lifted over, knotted at 23, deadlocked again. I think a little greedy there. 23, 23. Yeah! The key player on that point was Alex Trong. I think Jay made a little bit of a mistake with that pull, but Alex was ready there with their two-handed back end in the middle was able to catch Dylan Frazier off guard. Match point number one here for the Utah Black Diamonds. Alex Truong. Yeah. And it's Caitlin Christian Set very up. calmly, point does not 24. panic, does what she has to do. Yeah, I think that's the play for her. Keep leaning in, looking to take balls out of the air, especially when Truong is pushed back off the line. 24-24. Yeah! Utah again Side within out, one. 25. Alex Strong looking at Jay Davilia saying right now, let's see if they can close it out. 24. So many emotional swings. Second match point. Oh, Davilia. Oh. That out. little flick. That's, a tight flick off this battle. That's pressure right there. Twenty-five, twenty-five. Truong into the Point. net, and now Arizona can close it out. I think we're going to see a return to Caitlin Christian right here. Ernie, where were the feet? Yeah, very random sequence of events there. I do think that the replay system came into effect there. Correct call was made. All right, 15 seconds, players. Flow disrupted just a bit, but hey, it happens. And now Alex Strong again, tied at 26. 26, 26. Game still up for grabs. They got one. They need one more. Here we go. Another match 26. point for De Villiers. Yeah. They're going to hang in as Arizona. I think one of Frazier's volleys were going out there as well. 27 27. ATP, it's there for Caitlin. And now momentum back to the drive. Twenty-eight, twenty-seven. What a clutch play there from Caitlin. Oh, 
Davillier comes Set right back. Point 28. How about the pressure? Wanting to come through for your team. 28, 28. Kayla Christian, where well, she has been effective since that replay did not go her way. Yeah, the forehand volley out of the air has been the key for her. We'll see if she continues 29, it. 28. These next few points. Another match point here for Arizona. Caitlin Christian finding all the right shots. And Arizona barely squeaks by to keep this match alive and force a dream breaker. And Dylan Frazier, two of the best in the game, facing off. Side out, point one. One, one. So both of these guys known for their work in singles play. Two, one. And not surprising, it's a split. Two apiece. Two great singles players there. And now we have A.J. Kohler and Tyler Lung, both singles players as well. Two, Tyler two. does have the tennis background, which helps more. Point. hit long from Kohler. Tyler Lung, the 36th Three, pick two. in the latest MLP draft. That one's in as well. Lung is pumped up right now. So two in a row for Four, the Black two. Diamonds. Side out, point three. I'm really impressed with Lung's game here in general and his determination and energy out there. Got him that doubles win and then the mixed doubles Four. win as well. Let's see if he can do it in singles. Oh, Kohler, one shot right there. So far, talent on both sides kind of canceling each other four, out. Four. Caitlin Christian on the court. Alex Truong representing Utah. Point. I think this is where right here, Arizona feels that Five, they can four. pull away. Caitlin perhaps covers a little bit more court, a little bit more season tennis background as well. Yeah. Do not sleep on Alex Strong in singles, though. I've seen her play incredibly Six, well. Four. Point. I would love to see Alex take this return and Seven, try and come four. in, put a little more pressure on Caitlin here. That one just long, five. but it's a good sequence still for Arizona. So they take that one 3-1, and they've got hence a two-point lead. So Callie Smith on the court. Lacey Schneeman five, for Arizona. This is going to be a fun battle. Side out, point. Lacey Schneeman is just stone cold sometimes, isn't she? Eight, five. Yeah, incredible singles player. <laughs> Callie gets one Side back. Out, point six. And now Callie is predominantly a doubles player. Six, However, her eight. singles game is still very sharp. Oh. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Side out, point nine. 
Tough break that time for Smith. And if Schneeman can score here, Nine, it'll six. really put Arizona in great shape. Not going to happen, Side though. Cali able seven. to hang in. A little wild there from Schneeman. I think Cali did a good job with the return there, keeping the pressure coming seven, forward. Devillier and Frazier back at it. Side out. That's why. Point. Ten. Dylan Frazier is such a good volleyer that when he does take that return and approach into the kitchen, you feel like you have to do a lot on Ten, the pass. Seven. Point. Time out. Change in. It's Dylan Frazier seven, again Arizona. just before the side switch in Arizona right now, dictating just a bit. 11 7, leading Utah. Dylan Frazier. He is a magician on the court. Insane forehand. When he drops the head of that paddle, you almost feel like he's going inside out, and he pulled that one back inside in. I think Davilia read that wrong. Very cheeky there from Frazier. Let's see if he can do it again. Just no weaknesses to Dylan Frazier's game. And he hasn't even begun to reach his full potential yet in this great sport. Fifteen seconds. So Arizona, a four-point lead. Time in. Eleven, seven. Oh, it's off the edge of the paddle of Davillier. Maybe looked like it could have gone long there. However, Davillier not taking the chance. 12, 7. No! And misfired Side that out. time. Point. Off the Eight. paddle of Dylan still. Job well done for him. Call that the 2024 backhand of Dylan Eight, Frazier. 12. He's been adding that left hand, two-handed backhand. Very effective. Tyler Lunga to the net. Point 13. AJ in singles loves to drop, come in and play the cat and mouse. That's more of his strength than 13, the drive. Eight. Another point here for Tyler Lung in Utah. Utah can get this next point right here. It'll put some major pressure 10, on Arizona. Got to make up some of that deficit. Oh, cannot Side make out. it happen. And AJ Kohler able to hold court. Beautiful volley there from AJ on the stretch. Was able to still get the cross court angle. Lung is one of those guys. 14, With great 10. passing shots, so never easy. Alex Truong needs a big sequence, Point. but Caitlin Christian, she has done it all down the stretch. Yeah, talk about a good angle there from Caitlin. I love the idea, though, of coming 15, forward 10. on that return. Yeah. Alex Truong. Able to get the answer. Still within striking range. 11 15. A little tough Side miss. Out, point 16. That's an example of what returning and coming in can do because Alex Strong had 16, the open court. 11. It felt like she had to do too much. Seventeen eleven now in favor of the drive. 17, Just four 11. points away there, honing in. Sorry, I'll recall. Okay. 
We get her. Looks like AJ might have bumped into one of the challenge cameras there. 17 11. 17 11. Let's see what we play on here. I believe so. Near stoppage right there. Sneeman misses. A little distraction 12. here. Utah's going to try and take advantage of it. See the crowd still in their seats. 12 17. Oh, Lacey Schneeman. Oh, point. could have had a miraculous point had that connected. What an amazing singles point there from both players. Callie Smith trying to dig deep here. 13-17. Oh, 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 funny bounce, you Side can't up. get to it. Point. Insane. 18. The perfect spin, too, that just pulled away from Callie as she was trying to get there. 18, 13. Right. She's getting to this ball, but then just took a funny bounce. Yeah. Callie Side Smith, up. though, Point. able to hold 14. her own. And now these are must-win points coming up for Jay DeVillier. Let's go, Jay! 14, he has got 18. to get the better of Dylan Frazier here to stay alive. Yeah! It's easier said than done, but Jay with the big fist pump. It's 15-18. 15-18. I can't, I can't make a call. You have to challenge it. Side out. 19. There's been a challenge to the out call. This is going to be a challenge here. Side line. Time in. 19, 15. Yeah. Side out. Frazier misses out on 16. an opportunity there. De Villiers still has hope for Utah. 16, 19. Cross court, no problem. Out, point, 20. Amazing Ernie there. So De Frazier does his job. De Villiers almost worked 20, his way 16. into the kitchen there but too good from Bill Frazier. Match point, first one for Arizona. Tyler Loon pulling out every tool he has out of his toolbox to stay alive. Yeah, just so good by Loon. Really covering his area there in the kitchen. AJ trying to get up to the net there. Into the net. And remember, Arizona's got to end this on the serve. Yeah, one of the tough things about Major League Pickleball scoring. 2017. Look at this battle. Crowd loves it here in Grand Rapids. Side out, point 18. What an amazing match point that would have been. 18, 20. Both players just laying it all on the line. Side out. Young upset at himself there. And another match point coming up for the Arizona Drive. 20, 18. Alex Truong can't Eight. keep her team alive. And the Arizona 18. Drive Arizona. find a way. They're able to hang through some bumpy times here tonight. Tremendous here tonight.
and also Caitlin Christian, who was dynamic herself. And Caitlin, we'll start with you. I know that there were some real uh, peaks and valleys in that match, but man, did you come through big time late. What's going through your mind at the end of that match trying to keep things together? No, that was so much fun. Um, we have a great singles team, so anytime we get to a dream breaker, we're very, very confident as a team together. So really happy to pull through that one and get some rest and come back again tomorrow. All right, Lacey, you were outstanding yourself. And again, they had a lot of emotion on that Utah side. You guys, it looked like kind of hit a lull there. What made you guys kind of find yourselves late in that match? Uh, yeah, I think we certainly dealt with a, a few things there, um, you know, getting delayed in, in the start and then uh, rain delay and then the weird football thing at the end of the second mixed. Um, all of that was kind of, I don't know, thrown our way. Um, and I think, you know, kudos to, to KK, who really brought the energy, and Dylan, who were able to close that match out late um, and then, you know, push it to a dream breaker for us after a, a not so good performance from me and AJ. But, um, yeah, I was glad we were able to kind of come together as a team in the dream breaker and, uh, you know, I think we each pulled our, our weight, and KK especially, I think, uh, was really able to pull us through to the finish line. So I think it's only fair for her to have uh, clenched it for us. Absolutely. Certainly a lot of moving parts in that match. All right, guys, I want you to also tell us about what does Morgan Evans bring to your team? Because it seems like there's a lot of moments where his calming presence kind of settle, settles you guys down. Am I onto something there? No, absolutely. You know, he brings the jokes, if not anything. Like, he, he keeps it really light out there, and it's so much fun to see him on the sideline. He's very supportive, and um, me coming in as a new player, he gives me a lot of great advice, and um, I don't know a lot of these opponents, so having a good game plan heading into the matches is really, really key for us. So he's awesome. We're really happy to have him on the side. Yeah, the the Guys, Australian huge. accent helps as well. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it certainly does. Absolutely, Lacey. Lacey Schneeman, Caitlin Christian. Guys, so much fun watching you play. We'll see you along for the next few days, okay? Thank Thanks, you. Guys.